hi everyone welcome to Iman's garden channel today I want to update my video about Hoyas uh, nine months ago I saved this Hoya with you guys um, that video was about crinkly wrinkly wrinkly leaves how to bring the wrinkly uh, the Hoyas with wrinkly leaves to life back to life again you can go to that video and watch that video and this Hoyas um, I saved last year nine months ago with you guys uh, here on the table you see lots of Hoyas they were from the one plant I cut it that plant that was huge uh, long Hoya and uh, I lost its roots um, because I kept that Hoya under the rain and rain killed the Hoya roots root rot it happened root rot and that that's why the Hoya uh, started getting wilty wrinkly and I didn't like that and I decided to cut that Hoya into small parts and plant in these pots and here as you see uh, nobody can tell that this Hoya was dying last year as if it looks um, <coughs> new plant um, healthy plant nobody can tell that um, this Hoya is was unhappy before and now you see I will show you um, if you remember I propagated this plant outside on the table and I put uh, the some photos from the last year video if you want to go to that video you can go and watch that video also and here see I cut it uh, the Hoya into pieces see this is um, what I put here and this is what grew see it grew long size and it grew lots of new shoots see and it's very happy I planted this Hoya in a pot which doesn't have any drainage holes see still I didn't make any holes here see it doesn't have any drainage holes I put here some lava rocks to make drainage in the pot and I just planted this Hoya see how it's happy the leaves are shiny the old leaves which were wrinkly crinkly it lost and uh, it grew uh, new shoots new branches lots of new branches see it filled this pot see when you buy from the store Hoyas they just look like this Hoya and see I will turn this pot and I want to show you the roots how they are doing in the pot here see I made drainage with lava rocks see and the, with this lava rocks the roots can breathe it, uh, it, it there is no mud here um, and nothing is decaying in this pot and see how many roots I have all the roots are healthy white no brown roots and this Hoya just doing great in this uh, pot which doesn't have any drainage holes see lava rock how it's working and the Hoya is very happy all of them are just happy see here this one all of them they have same size uh, branches see they are growing crazy and what I do every time when I see that the top soil is completely dry I put just half cup of water in these pots and the water is of course with a fertilizer I use fertilizer from my orchids leftover fertilizer I don't throw away that water and I put in this I feed them these Hoyas with those fertilizers after my orchids see how they are growing healthy 
dark green leaves, shiny leaves, even though they're a little bit uh, dusty. If I wipe it, see how it's looking great. Even with the dust there looking, you can see that they're healthy and happy. And I tried to, tried to uh, plant some of the cuttings uh, in this kind of plastic pots. This kind of plastic pots. And they were not happy. That's why I replanted some of them in this kind of pots without drainage holes. And they are doing just great. This one is new. I just planted it. See? and it's doing now great it started growing new shoots see i just propagated this hoya and this pot doesn't have any drainage holes also this method works for me try if uh, this method will work for you too this pot is big pot and i put my uh, hoya carnosa here these are all hoya carnosas and this one is doing great too see it's growing new branches it's new propagation also see sometimes uh, they the this uh, leaves die and i take them see old leaves the crinkly old leaves old leaves that they die and i take them and throw away and only just new branches and new leaves they uh, stay here and day by day this Hoya uh, will look more pretty see and this was my update I uh, here is my um, Hoya Hindu rope my Hindu rope Hoya uh, sometimes you know the Hoyas they lose some of the uh, branches not the whole Hoya some of the branches can be broken or something will happen and they started getting wilty and not shiny that time i just take just cut this uh, that uh, branch and put in water and after uh, they root i plant see how i propagated my hoyas and here this is hoya yeti see this, uh, this some part from that um, I have outside big Hoya Vaieti in the previous video I showed it for you guys and from that Hoya some part was uh, dying and that uh, branch I cut just put here in water then I planted it in a pot in this pot and see how it's doing great now I have new Hoya Vaieti in a new pot this way I propagate my Hoyas. If you want to see other pots, other roots, I will show you how the others roots doing. I will just squeeze pot a little bit, just loose it up and turn it like so and show you the roots. See, the roots are white no decaying no bad smell the bottom part is dry as you see because i don't put much water i just put half cup of water and make the top soil wet see top soil wet and the water it makes evenly moist the the rest of the soil see all evenly moist see i watered it two days ago and see how it's doing no water is sitting in here in the pot the pot is dry and the lava rock is dry also see lava rock is not falling if i uh, it's falling okay <laughs> i i saw that it's not falling but it can fall if i turn it down okay this way I planted my Hoyas and some of them I planted in this kind of pots and this is not bad also here uh, it keeps 
left over water but I don't put much water I just make the topsoil wet and that's it I don't uh, let the water go down I don't water that much see it's doing great all of them are doing great that was my update guys update video uh, if you like this video please put thumbs up if you are not subscribed yet uh, please subscribe see you next time bye